So we've been into the pandemic now for a couple of years. And have you forgotten what the market was pre-pandemic? I know I have. And so I've gone back and pulled some numbers. So let's talk about what's changed and how it benefits you. You hear all the stuff on the news today, but what was reality before the pandemic? Let's talk about that. So prior to the pandemic, interest rates were actually higher. So a positive for the buyers is the fact that they actually are paying less interest today. And interest rates prior to the pandemic had been four and, and at one point had even gotten as high as 5%. Today, they're still down in the threes, although we are anticipating that they will go up. But that's just what the market's going to do. Understand that this market always moves. So interest rates during the pandemic have been fabulous. At some points, gotten into the twos. Unheard of. This average sales price has actually gone up 24% since the pandemic. So January of 2020, your house that you would have sold for $293,000, today would actually be worth and sell for $363,000. That's $70,000 in two years, 24%. That's huge. The market time, the amount of time it takes to sell a home has actually decreased. It was over 100 days pre-pandemic. Since then, it's gotten as low as 35 days. Right now, we're hovering around the 60-day mark. So understand that it's taking less time to sell a home. The number of homes for sale, which means competition to you, right? So if you're looking to sell, you always want to sell when there's less competition. Pre-pandemic, we were hovering in the 30,000 range. Today, we're down in the 12 to 15, 18,000 range. So that is huge because if you've got 50% less competition, then you can expect more money. And that's exactly why these prices have been driven up during the pandemic. So if you've got any questions or interested in buying or selling, we'd love to be able to help you. Have a great day.